Hi, good afternoon, Houston. Luis Medina here, your Texas realtor. And I know a couple of you saw that uh, I had a closing today earlier in uh, for a house in Cyprus where I got my clients into this incredibly gorgeous home. Uh, and uh, they were so extremely happy. Even though we had to wait at the title company for four hours to get that document closed, I don't know why they were taking so long, but uh, I was there from beginning to end just to make sure that if there's any issues that come up, I'm there to handle them. Uh, but I'm actually here for another reason. Uh, this here is a check for $2,000. And what happened with this, this is not even my client. This is a, uh, another realtor in the office. They were going on vacation. They said, hey, I have a transaction that's about to close. Could you take care of my clients? And uh, they're going to close on this day. So we just handle whatever happens. You could just handle it. I said, sure. Uh, what would happen is this buyer wasn't entirely happy with their home so they end up canceling the day before closing and i advised them you know since their realtor wasn't here i advised them i said if you cancel uh this transaction you don't have any reason you're just canceling because you're getting buyer's remorse or you're getting scared or for what for whatever reason you're gonna lose your earnest money and in this price range that's about two thousand dollars and i said you're gonna lose it i said uh I'll, we'll try best to get it back for you, but it's not guaranteed. You will lose this money. And I said, it's okay. I'd rather lose the money than buy the house. I said, all right, fine. Uh, for whatever reason, I don't know what happened with the house. I wasn't there to negotiate price. I wasn't there to show them the houses and to do all that stuff. So I don't know how happy they were with submitting an offer on this house or not. I just know I was there at the end. <clears throat> so they canceled. This is about a month and a half ago. And uh, of course the seller says, no, we're not giving them their earnest money back. We're keeping it. They're canceling at the last minute without reason. So we're keeping their money. They're not getting their $2,000 back. Well, this was a month ago and I've been trying and I've been calling and I've been sending emails and finally I convinced them uh, to give her the money back. And this is not even my client. I just, when I saw what was happening that, you know, this is a hardworking lady. She has about two to three jobs and minimum wage, uh, cleaning offices. So $2,000, that's a lot of money. I mean, that's a lot of money for me. So I can imagine what it is for her, the significance of this money for her. And so uh, today they were closing on that house and I, and I knew they were closing today because I kept in contact, you know, I have my ways of figuring that out. And um, I showed up and I said, hey, I need you to sign this. And uh, the, the seller happy now that they're closing or for whatever reason he went ahead and signed it and so now my well not my client but she gets her money back so uh, the whole reason of this video is that when you're buying a house there is the risk that you can lose your earnest money so you got to make sure especially this is your first time your agent should disclose that to you and you need to have your agent fight for you so if you cancel the minimum that your agent has to do because they're representing your best interest per the Texas Real Estate Commission, they should at least ask for your money back. But uh, as, as I mentioned before, I really uh, like to go above and beyond for my clients. And uh, it took me about uh, two months, but I got her her money. So if you're looking for a great agent, you're looking for an aggressive agent that's gonna protect your money, that's gonna get you the best deal, that's gonna negotiate hard for you, that's gonna prove their worth, Give me a call. My number is 713-884-0502, Luis Medina, or you can reach out my, uh, at my website, tophoustonhomes.com. You guys have a great weekend. Thank you for, for uh, watching the videos. If you have any questions, give me a call. I'm here to serve. Thank you.